to Araujo, who absolutely flat left wing for Real Madrid. Back for Real Madrid, but Nacho has filled in all the way across the back during his career. Still not signed a new contract. The number six for Real Madrid. Looks for the nutmeg, Vinicius. To be fair, Ramos hadn't played for Spain for the last two years anyhow. Speaks quite a bit. Nice, lovely little turn there to get past the first challenge, but... The finish. He's a little bit disappointing. Times 11 wins, one draw and one defeat. As I say, referee very much in the spotlight today after these. Valverde and the assistant of Tata Martino both said they never saw hide in a hair of any tech. The Monero Montero today will be put under the microscope. Out it goes to Arojo. Uruguayan fully fit again, obviously, after once again Vinicius looking to take on Araujo. Looks for the one-two, the Uruguayan wins the position, though, gets it back to Ter Stegen, who... Benzema lines up the shot, takes a deflection... And out that one goes for another corner. That's not a bad ball looking for Benzema. So looking at Barca, the injuries have really affected the bench today. Let's not forget, is the boyfriend of... Former Spain coach Luis from Carvajal, isn't he? He does. The Kunde reading the ball very well. Just to remind you that away girls in this tournament do not count double anymore. With Benzema. A block by Kessi. Gavi wins that one from Vinicius. Benzema and Vinicius picks himself up. Arojo, sorry. It is indeed Arojo and Rafinha. Both have very similar colour hair on the tops of their heads, although Arojo is built like a tree. The end is Carvajal. And that's, well, not a great clearance. And I wonder where that hit. It is the 5th of April. Ten ah, lovely work from Valverde. Looks for Benzema. Arojo gets there, Busquets. That's a lovely ball. Benzema, can he turn? So just weight of numbers. Not allowing the Frenchman room. Barca, a little bit anyway. Arojo. Bejong. And that's gone out. Kessi. And Arojo just punts that one forward. Not very much a chance from Kessi was virtually the only chance they had. It was a cross from Gabi Tex as a player of Barca's. Hang on a second. Here is Vinicius deflected wide. It's Valverde. Once again, it's Araujo. And once again, Araujo. See, has never played against Barca for Real Madrid. Overall, he's flattered to deceive at Real Madrid. Steadying influence for Barca along with Busquets. Just when he's needed. So Barca's in options were a little bit more limited. That's a decent delivery. Once again, though, Kunde in the right place. Dinked upwards, Kunde is underneath it. Rafinha helps it on, but there's nobody to help. Vinicius again. Once again, he's got Arujo in close proximity. Once again, the defence. And well defending there, just shit. Shepherding Kamavinga out. Although it is another corner. Yeah, 
Yeah, just goes in off his off his foot. De Jong just keeps it steady. Kunde. Rafinha. Looks for a gap that's not there. Again, Rafinha and ah, Arojo strides forward and say this man's a central defender normally, but he's a very quick central defender. Getting ready to come on for Barca. Once again, Kunde wins another header. Trying to get that form he had before his his knee injury, his four subsequent operations, and a bad hamstring injury. There, Arujo goes down, stays down as well. And Barca, this is one player I would say Barca will definitely not want to see injured. He's Madrid with an effort from outside of the area. Kunde. Decent delivery to the far post, it's well kept in. Again, big appeals for handball. It in. Mm. Once again, Arujo, that's probably a good candidate for man of the match, along with Kunde, you'd say, wouldn't you? For Once again, Vinicius, that's a, another ball. Held in with the outside of his... So he scored his first goal. Getting the referee out of a little bit of trouble there, just catching Kunde, and the fans were getting a little bit annoyed. Yeah, he just catches him there, doesn't he? Ben Thema going and helping his... I don't think Barca could have complained, perhaps, if it had been another minute on that. Obviously not been any great hurry to take set pieces. Ah, oh, Kunde does really well to get across. Arvajal, can he curl it in? It's a decent delivery, there's no one there at the far post. Arojo clears only as... Cannoning about. And wide it goes. Corner, says the... Corner, let's have a look again. There's no offside. I'm, yeah, might have gone off. Could be a defining moment of the season if Barca lost.